The UNSC is entrusted with the task of maintaining peace, harmony and security all over the world. The UNSC has 15 members and every member has the right to exercise one vote. The decision of the Security Council is binding, and it must be followed by every member state. Whenever the peace of the world is threatened, the UNSC takes the initiative to determine how the aggression will be halted after discussing with the member states and the parties involved in the act of aggression. Sometimes, the UNSC imposes sanctions and even approves the use of force whenever required to maintain peace. The veto power in UNSC. Five nations, the United States UK China France and the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics, played a key role in the establishment of the United Nations, and that is why they enjoy certain special privileges in the UN. They are the permanent member states at the UNSC, and also have a special voting power known as the right to veto. If any one of them cast a negative vote in the UNSC, the resolution or decision would not be approved. All five permanent members have exercised the right of veto. If a permanent member does not fully agree with a proposed resolution but does not wish to cast a veto, it may choose to abstain, thus allowing the resolution to be adopted if it obtains the required number of nine favorable votes. The veto power is possibly the most significant difference between a permanent member and a non-permanent member. According to Article 27.3 of the UN Charter, Council will take all decisions with the concurring votes of the permanent members. The topic of the veto power is highly controversial and has been debated in UN meetings itself over the years. It is among the topics most frequently raised in the context of almost all discussions of Council working methods. Russia vetoed a UNSC resolution, demanding that Moscow immediately stop its attack on Ukraine and withdraw all troops, a defeat the United States and its supporters knew was inevitable. The vote was 11 in favor, with Russia voting no and China, India and the United Arab Emirates abstaining, which showed significant but not total opposition to Russian President Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine. This is it for this video. Check out this video and learn how an actor become president of Ukraine. Also if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like and subscribe to the channel.